was very motivated because um, I saw the Monday meetings really hurting morale in the school district. And um, I also wanted to advocate for our um, wages. Wyndham was very low on the pay scale. We weren't last all the time, but we were low with, with the amount we were getting paid. And then put in, if you averaged out, if you, you can't really do it with teachers, but if you averaged out like the per hour, you know, the hours we were, we were required to work and what we were being paid, it really was low. In terms of the length of school days, um, teacher hours, student hours, PD days, um, all that information and then bringing it back to salary and breaking it down by hourly wages and comparing us to others and providing that to the Wyndham Board of Education when we were in the negotiation process, it really helped solidify and make that clear. It was very clear how underpaid we are in comparison to other districts near us. Our town is very economically challenged and we have a, a very archaic system where we have to pass a budget every year. We have a, a Board of Finance that will cut our budget to bare bones and it's a real tough um, battle every year to get the budget passed. And we were able to knock down at least one of those Monday meetings that were mandatory. We increased our tuition bank so people get paid a little bit more for their college classes and um, the stipend for um, committee work during the summer. We also were able to remove two half-day professional development days in our calendar so that we'll be with kids more. It's the second straight three-year contract where we've got step raises every time. I really did not know the contract before I got into the negotiating committee and now I have a really good grasp of it. You really feel empowered and you also feel like you made a contribution to everybody and to the students, the teachers, the parents in the, in the town by really coming up with the best agreement. Instead of sitting on the sidelines and complaining about your contract and what you don't have or what you didn't get, be part of the process of coming to a, to a solution to make things better for everybody else and being part of that team. You and I in union.